this person that tried to block you that was a friend or a colleague um just really try to stop your birthright get in the way i want to know what's going on with them okay nine of cups something about a dream come true um celebration self-love union out in the cold um no chance to they they're not loving themselves they don't feel like there's any chance to reconcile they feel like there was a lot of pure love that you gave to them now they feel out in the cold with that they feel like uh it was very stable with you and a place to manifest um and that the issue is that there's a dream come true though or somebody's very smug and happy, it seems like. They're trying to figure, they feel like they're in a bit of a blur or an illusion. They're trying to figure out what to do. Um, they're trying to figure out their options. They feel like they might still have options. Um, someone displayed a lot of strength in their recent past. It could have been them. They're trying to figure out, um, they're, they're going to have to look deep, deep within here. Um, at this situation in the near future they're going to be planning something um or dealing with the seeds that they planted some sort of communication around money and wealth or some fast movement some decision that's been made in the environment position it looks like they're walking away towards something more meaningful or you are they really want this ten of cups or they're concerned about this Ten of Cups, happy family, joyful circumstances. The outcome is Eight of Pentacles, them spending a lot of time working on something. And under the deck, we have King of Cups and the King of Swords is kind of popping out. So they might be trying to keep their emotions together about something. This, uh, or presenting like, like they're fine. Or they might feel kind of balanced at the moment. Um, with this Hermit card, they might not really know what's going on with you. Let's get, let's get some clarifications. Nine of Cups. Page of Wands. Some like happy news. There's some sort of happy news. The issue is happy news. The messages. They seem happy about something... Or there, there's the chance for happiness because then clarifying this Nine of Cups, it's also the, the problem is also the solution. The solution is the problem because Nine of Cups upright, the, the challenge is the Nine of Cups crossing it. So it's like greed, materialism, imperfection. It's like, it's all, almost like something slipped out of someone's hands. Something like that. Something that could be very happy. So in other words, like, if they did something to try to sacrifice you, they ended up sacrificing themselves. And they also lost a friend or someone that was... So it's like, in one sense, they might feel like they won something. Um, which, that's their perspective right now. Um... But the fact that you were coming from this loving place, it just, it's, it's, it's really, um, they're feeling very dirty. Um, hidden mo mo more motives, ignorance. In their subconscious, they're still trying to figure out. this fog that they were in, or they're still in some kind of a fog, but like their reasoning behind everything that they did, they, they haven't quite um, figured out why they do what they do. Strength card, prosperity without happiness, death reverse. So we've got Ace of Pentacles reverse, death reverse, and um, eight of pentacles so they've been really working on something um but it's been very like their life has been very immobile there's been sort of like a forced change and they, nothing has been really 
um, coming towards them, but they've been trying to stay confident um, anyway and try to feel like everything is okay. This Hermit card, the best they can do, they're feeling like the best they can do. Yeah, I think this has to do with like watching you because they don't, they don't know what's going on with you because you've pretty much gone silent in their eyes. Something to do with this Ten of Pentacles here. They're trying to plan something or something that was planned that they planted some seeds. Um, there's a Ten of Pentacles that they're concerned with. Wealth, um, a big windfall or something like that. They're planning around that here and here here we've got again this ten of pentacles communication hierophant this could do with um tradition or marriage or some final um decision that's been made around that um and so they might be trying to pursue something here that's what i'm feeling um They've been working on something. There's something that feels like they're still watching you. Um, I don't know if whatever this is, because I know that this is cre creativity mantra energy as well. So there's something about this that feels like th things have been stagnant. There's something they feel sort of happy about what they did to you. Um, or there's happy news. And for them, they in some cases for you, you might they, there might be news of something going on with you that's happy and that's making them feel out in the cold like they have no love and no chance to manifest and no stability because they were greedy so and then they're just planning on watching you because they're very alone um and because of your strength they've been very stagnant and things haven't been coming towards them even though they've been working really hard at it but they're going to be planning something in regards to this ten of pentacles here maybe communicating online and they could be looking at you that way, like you're doing well. Eight of Cups, somebody does not want to commit. We've got this Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. Someone wants to walk away from this person. Whoever this is does not want the commitment. They do not want to be part of whatever this is in this person's life. And people can see that, that someone's walking away from a commitment with them. This Ten of Cups, they're really concerned with this Ten of Cups. Feeling off balance or getting in alignment again. The outcome is this Hermit, Eight of Pentacles, just um, somebody working on something really just alone here. Or having to take a deeper look at what they put their efforts into. This has to do with... Um, this, per this person, if they're in a relationship, there could be some choices around a relationship. This King of Cups in their life could be walking away. This could be you walking away. There could be some decision around a contract and they're still kind of like watching to see what happens with it, but they're not sure what's going on. They might feel a little bit like of like excitement around the possibility that they have permanently damaged your outlook but they're not sure, but they kind of feel happy about what they think they might have done, but then they also injured themselves. But again, some of you, there are messages of like a happy achievement, a wish come true, and this is making them feel out in the cold. To do with a main male. The dog's having a bad dream. Hold on. Even my dog doesn't like this energy. Being stuck in some sort of agreement due to a main male. So there could be like a message having to do with a main male that is about a, a choice in in agreement where someone's stuck someone's in like spiritual jail like a message 
of a dream come true that somebody is stuck. But then this sudden wealth, there's a loss of sudden wealth because somebody is stuck. A message that someone's stuck. Something is over with this wealthy man, something to do with a house or a group, or they're trying to plan something with this wealthy man. They're doing something in secret. Something is ended, something to do with this house. I don't know yet what that is. I'll get clarification. False person. Yeah, they've been presenting as if they're happy, even though things haven't been going well for them. They're thinking they're going to have to spend a lot of time trying to um, look deeper into a situation. That's, that's the thing is that they might be feeling like they're getting fooled by something. Um, they, seem, they feel happy that they might have done something, but they're not sure and things aren't working out for them. But the, again, that's why it's sort of an illusion because they're not sure what they did. It's like getting happy too quickly that they, you know, because there's a hermit. You're not showing any anyone anything. So maybe there's some absence here with this hermit. So, or they could be feeling a little bit alone and um, like they're being watched. But I think mostly it's them feeling like they need to look more deeply into a situation and continue to watch you and spy um, to see if anything comes to you because they feel, yeah, there's that unexpected income, this pathway. They're trying to plan something, this 10 of pentacles in the near future for like money or an opportunity um in despair over this ten of pentacles communication there could be something to do with fortune a big windfall some big contract some marriage that's a money money marriage communication a final decision that's been made about it just really in their head a lot about the situation, some opportunity for great fortune, but if they're in despair about it, that's not good. This Eight of Cups, somebody does not want to, this person, if they're married, this person could be potentially losing. If they were being taken care of or something like that, it looks like there's potential that it's not um, going to work out. Um, this journey, message of concern so somebody is definitely leaving and not wanting to commit to this person there could be something that this person is seeing like a document or an email or message or something online that they're seeing that someone's walking away um, or other people can see this as well because this is in the environment position mature man i think there can some cases could be concerned that you are going to find this joy or happiness with someone and and find stability in spite of what they've done or they could be having a problem with this hierophant situation in their own life and unable to establish happiness there's going to be a change in the near future um in regards to whatever they've been putting their work into um, that they're feeling like now they're ha they have to spy and watch it's interesting because we've got this like hermit here they're feeling like they're gonna have to look more deeply into something or maybe spend time alone um, and the outcome is that they end up working maybe alone on something or someone's working alone on something this has to do with occupation as well so so this could be somebody like a work colleague who was after you um and or someone who was concerned with like a soulmate connection that's got in the way lovers imprisonment yeah, somebody lost something, but somebody's happy about it. 
someone seems stuck and lo like they've lost something. And it's really them that lost. This thing that they tried to, you know, trap someone. It's like they trapped themselves and they're having an emotional dark night of the soul about it, even if they, they've won. But they're not sure that they won. Um, it could be someone around them that is really not well because of all of this work that they've been doing to try to stop someone. They could be trying to do, this person could be somebody that does like kitchen magic or something like that and is trying to, they feel like they need to put more work in on somebody that maybe you are connected to who might be per a powerful person. Or they might know about your, if this is someone who knows your DM, um, they might know something about this person who isn't well. In a recent past, they, they might have needed some help here or tried to get help from an expert on something and try to appear to be strong because things weren't working out for them. Yeah, this, they're planning on, they're, they're going to have to be alone here or they're looking to someone who seems very alone because we've got room, there's no one in this room, and then Hermit. This is very um, lonely in their thoughts. They're going to think a lot about something and be clever, but they're going to do it alone or they're going to look into someone who's alone. So there's going to be um, unexpected income and a pathway that comes up in this person's life or that's what they're going to be focused on. Yeah, this gift, gift and fortune. There's a gift and a fortune coming up. This falseness card almost came out, but I'm going to put it back in the deck. So either this is something that you've been planning that they are unaware of, um, this pathway, this unexpected income, or this is them trying to focus on their own now. Um, and then with this despair, they're all about these pentacles, these ten of pentacles. And it's got them in despair. Could be some sort of message, because we've got Eight of Wands message. Eight of Wands can definitely be some sort of email communication having to do with the Hierophant. I feel like that could be, tra it's tradition, like the law. I mean, usually I don't think of the law with Hierophant, but it could be in this case, despair over some communication having to do with a big windfall. So they're thinking a lot about it right now. They might want you to be out in the cold and they're in despair because it seems like that's not what's happening. And they're trapped with having lost something. They had a dream come true and now they lost it and they're trapped. This person is trapped in decisions that they made. They've been very corrupt and, and untruthful and they've taken a loss. They could have lost some contract or marriage or could be losing a lot of money in despair, receiving some sort of message around this Ten of Pentacles that they've been trying to build. Journey message, consolation. Somebody seems like the very, like, mostly focused in on God or the divine or could be begging someone for help or something like that that's just walking away. This person could be begging someone not to walk away. Like there'd be some message. This is whatever this is. This is like in this person's environment that people can see. Somebody is um, needs help and is walking away. There's some sort of message around someone who needs help and is walking away.
friend money, some sort of person who's a friend that, that might get money and happiness and love. They're concerned with that. Outcome is just a, a melancholic change. Here's the false person at the bottom of the deck, and we have a false person here. So this person is dealing with the fact that they're, they've been false and wearing a mask, having to do with whatever thing it is that they're focused on work-wise or project-wise, like business-wise. This person tried to stop you. Um, Gonna get one more layer of clarifications to understand where they're at. They definitely don't seem to be in um, a great state of affairs. It feels like they're trying to pretend everything is fine. Um, let's see. Widower, lovers, imprisonment. Once you back but are blocked, they've imprisoned themselves. You are a dream come true. And it, it, they're blocked. Messages. It's like you gave them inspiration. Dust it off. It's like you're moving on this opportunity. This person is like stuck. And you're over there dodging bullets, their bullets, and you're walking away from them. And they want you back. You were like this dream come true. There's some person, wealthy man, boss daddy, wolf in sheep's clothing, stalker, child services. It's like somebody is mentally unwell. There's an ending. Someone's sick. Someone could be, oh, with this malady. This could be mentally unwell, high priestess in reverse, stalker, subconscious. It could be like a male, male energy who's like a leader that's in their subconscious that they've been stalking or is feeling like they're sick because they're dealing with this person or this person has been like working on them or something like that something kind of creepy and it has to do with and we've got death card here too like this person could be making someone sick who is like there's some sort of abuse or somebody is just mentally unstable and is acting like they are a good person but it's like it's making someone sick to the point where they could literally pass on because we've got this coffin here coffin card obsessed stalker wolf in sheep's clothing and this is in the subconscious because they're just they, they're continually planning something and in this illusion they're in this illusion and high priestess reverse they're trying to tune into something like arcane knowledge but in a really like dark way and is stalking and obsessed but it's connected to this boss daddy who um in, in a reporting something, neglect, abuse, they might be feeling like they're being seen in this way. In the house too, if they're someone that's in a relationship with someone that is like a powerful person or has money, this person could be getting sick. Um, or there's someone in their life that is in their, this person's subconscious that is, is unwell and is like, this person knows that someone's feeling that way about them. It's like they've been caught because we've got all this false discards. They feel like they're being caught for something that's darker than what most people can see. And it has to do with the male energy that's a boss. Like then ego 
ego fan, like their relationships or their egos getting in the way here in the recent past. Um, there might have been a lawyer or someone like that trying to help them, but they were being false and kind of like cheery and acting like they were the ones who were kind of upstanding, but things were just going very corrupt and they were trying to get help from somebody. But they were being very false. And the hermit here, broke ass, broke ass forcer, someone's running, they're still talking shit about someone who moves in silence and trying to follow them on social media. Yeah, they're still tripping on you. They're like planning on still following you. It's like, it's almost like they're becoming more of a hermit trying to follow someone who doesn't really let them know what's going on. They know that you're kind of trying to run away from them or don't want to be near them or have anything to do with them. But they're planning on still gossiping and spying to find out what's going on with you. In the near future, with this Seven of Pentacles and this Ten of, Pen uh, Ten of Pentacles, gift, fortune, has to do with money for sure, accomplishments, Things like that. Something unexpected. Maybe a surprise around money. What's going on with that? Fed up. Happiness hater. Okay, right. So I think this has to do with... They don't know what's going on with you. They think they potentially might have won something, but they're not sure. They want you back because they're just not sure. They feel blocked. Like they blocked their own blessings and they lost you. But looks like something you've been working on. Um, they, be, they, be, they become made aware of it and they become, or something happens for you, good. You, there's a pathway for you here and this person just can't stand it. They can't stand it because they want what you have. They've been trying to take your whole life over or something. And whatever it is that you've been hiding isn't good. They might have been trying to do something here legally or within a system of somehow like communicating things back and forth, trying to present something to make their own wealth or something like that. But it was dirty. It was, there was something fake about it. And there's some messages going back and forth that has left this person in despair. Like they've almost like they've tried to create a 10 of pentacles without you. Like, but building on what you you have been doing somehow whatever it is they're in despair over it a message one more for dirty offer <laughs> that's just an offer dirty offer an offer ten of pentacles some sort of offer having to do with money they're looking at it and they are in despair it's a message that has to do with an offer. It's a big windfall or a chance to live the life, live the good life. It's something that's based on tradition, but that there's a message that they're in despair about in regards to that. This message, dirt digging. People could, in their environment, could be trying to like message there's something about a message people can tell that they're like people could be looking into you but it's like you're walking away or someone someone's walking away here someone seems desperate about it and that's them wanting you back here in their life yeah i think they want a friendship with you that's this ten of cups but then there's a mature man here as well this might be someone who's like just jealous of wow love triangle okay so they could be in a relationship where somebody is um cheating um and because they've been unhappy with this person because of the way they've been so obsessed with you this person's walking away and um, they could be competing with another um person the other thing that could be going on is that this person has, if they're same sex, um, but you're not attracted to same sex, they might be attracted to you and are competing with whatever soulmate comes into your life because 
they, it's, or they also might fight like competing with you relationship wise. They don't want you to be happy. They don't want you to have a man or a woman in your life. They don't want you to have a ten of cups. So they're wondering if you are, um, you have someone. Your light irritates their demons is the outcome with this change. This person's going to be melancholy while you are working and spending time very diligently focused on something. Um, maybe alone or very much focused in on work and they can't get to you. Um, or they're very alone or something changes where they end up alone because of what's going on here with this Ten of Pentacles situation. They just see you as someone who's just rising up and that they're wasting time because they can't, they're just, they're stuck. They don't really know what to do. Um, they're just presenting a false version of themselves um, as like a balanced person, but really they have a lot of bad habits and they're experiencing a lot of karma in a weird way. They're attracted to you um, and just very, uh, very triggered right now by how unbothered you are just focused on work, but they just have no, no facts on you. And the more uninterested you are, the more, more obsessed they are with you. Um, and you seem to be unfazed, even though they might have even taken it as far as like um, legal stuff or, or things like that. You just, you always seem happy, even though they, they keep talking about you and they've been trying to, you know, make it so that you lose a lot stop you from working trying to ruin your reputation and they do this a lot they do they put a lot of work into it um but still this jackpot's coming to you and they're, they've just been crying over you um and you're ignoring them and they feel like an idiot and people around them are questioning their what what they've been doing this whole time um, and also something's coming out about them being attracted to you in a weird way and trying to actually hustle you and make, make you go, go bankrupt or lose everything. And people are thinking that they've lost their chance already and stop looking you up and, and focusing in on you for all the wrong reasons. And there are still a bunch of their friends, um, I think a lot of them are tired of this, like looking through your social media and gossiping and doing this whole campaign. A lot of them are moving away from from this situation. A lot of them are confused at why they were partaking in something of like creeping on you and focusing in on you. And a lot of them feel really haunted by by this whole thing. A lot of them feel really haunted. So there you go. That is what's going on with this bully stalker um and hope that helps bye